Hello, good people, and welcome to Excel Hacks for Productivity. One trick, two minutes to learn, hours saved every day. In this short video, we'll learn how to combine text and create dates in Excel. If you have a situation where your date components are split into different columns, and you need to combine the elements to create one date, as I have here, I have month, day, and then year in separate columns C, D, and E. And in F, I want to create one date. You can use the date function. And the date function allows you to bring in the year, which is what I have in E5. And I'll bring my comma and the month. The only challenge we have with this is normally this month should be expressed as a number so that this function can work but here we have the number expressed as a text or a month name the workaround is to introduce the function month and when we bring month we select the month name and then join it with an ampersand with one so this process will force us to get a month number for this particular portion of the date. So I'm done with the month, I'll bring my comma and then bring day. So I have my three components, my year 2019, my month and my day. So when I press enter, I get my dates created from the combination. I can format it using Control shift hash and then copy it down using Control d So you realize that I now have a dynamic date created from the three columns. So please practice and add it to your list of Excel tricks. For more videos, you can send add to this WhatsApp number. You send videos directly to your WhatsApp on Mondays and Fridays. All our old videos are on our YouTube channel, Excel Hacks for Productivity. Click subscribe for notification of new videos or give us a like on our Facebook page. Thanks for watching and have a wonderful day.